Hello. Welcome back to Cut Above Tarot. This is your solo tarot message. This message is for those that are not attached to anyone, those that are seeking love, or those that are just single and enjoying themselves just the way they are. All right? So sit back and enjoy. Hopefully something to come out in this reading that you really like. And yes, we're starting with the zodiac sign of Sagittarius. So let's find out what are the love messages for those on the zodiac sign of Sagittarius. Sagittarius, you have an ace of swords here. So new opportunities when it comes to love. New opportunities to be in balance. Stable. Taking some trips. Look like there's some duality going on here as well. There's a possibility that you put an end to something. Maybe this dual dual uh, personality of yours. All right? And you're going towards seeking something better. Some, seeking something else. Something much nicer. Maybe you just want to change your the way that you speak with others. Uh, how you approach your response. Well, let's see what else we get from Sagittarius. Okay, Sagittarius, you have the Wheel of Fortune. Seven of Coins. And the Star Card. Well, we see that you have... New opportunities twice here when it comes to love. Okay. You can do some traveling and find love. Or you can stay home and still find love. The two of wands is talking about a duality as well as talking about taking a trip. But this looks like you're indecisive on what you want to do. You really haven't made your mind up whether or not you're ready to uh, start something new. However, you got the death card here, which tells me that you're ready to put this to an end, being indecisive. Okay? But you are ready for these two new opportunities. You got opportunities, new beginnings, okay, fresh starts, a lot of communication, clarity coming in. And this is you getting clarity within yourself. And you said, you know, stop that. So now you're ready to put an end to that. All right? Seven of Coins is talking about your money. Working hard for your money and enjoying your rewards. Okay? Drawing the fruit of your labor. Also, this card talks about having a lot of passion. Possibly Sagittarius, you do have a lot of passion, but you're trying to figure out where you want to put this passion. You could be also torn between two different people here, okay? Two different people, and you also want to stay stable and balanced. And that could also have something to do with your passion. But it looks like you want to make sure that you're satisfied. Putting an end to something, oh, this duality of thinking, and all of these ideas or these thoughts, okay, and which way you want to go, who you want to be with. You got a lot of hope and faith. You are connected to divine source. But your energy says that you are harmless as a lamb. They want you to temper your energy. Don't be in a hurry to make no sudden 
certain decisions. Okay? When it comes to these new opportunities, there are some delays that are set in place on purpose. Allow yourself to continue healing. And as far as you have in this duality, which is passion, your desire is going to be answered. The Ten of Cups, a wish being granted. After a lot of hard work been put in, you're going to be not just granted, but you're going to be fulfilled because you worked on yourself. You worked on changing this right here about you. And this is going to be your end reward. You're going to get that, that person that you've been waiting for or the one that you've been manifesting. He or she is coming. Ace of Coins. This card can also symbolize a wish being granted, but a divine wish. Prosperity. Because you are connected. So, Sagittarius, continue. Continue, Sagittarius, to follow your divine purpose and listen. Be sensitive to the spirit so you can get this Ten of Cups, which is rightfully yours. I'm going to get you a Love Oracle card from the Island Time Wellness Love Oracle deck. Mm. The card that jumped out is the heart, the Healing Heart card. It says healing from heartbreak, freedom from toxic relationships or addictions. So that is what you're doing at this time. Not all Sagittarius, but some. You're healing your heart. Just like we mentioned earlier, your heart is being healed from toxic relationships or addictions. All right, Sagittarius. This is your first solo message in the series.